episode of、uh, My Travel Destination, I'm going to take you to Zuma, visiting the most beautiful mountain in Switzerland called Matterhorn. The total journey for, from Mont Blanc to Zermatt takes about 2 hours and 80 minutes. On the way to Zermatt, we pass through a beautiful town called Grimes. Here it is. I will show you later on in my next episode of my travel destinations. Hi, my name is Rosaria. Welcome to my channel, My Travel Destinations. First, I will show you the car. Train ride from the town called、uh, Kenniston to Cobblestein. Next,、uh, Zuma City. Next, train ride from、um, Zuma to Gondograd. Finally, Matterhorn, a beautiful mountain in Zuma. The trip to Zuma from Mont Blanc is a colorful one as well. You can see more on the car trip compared to other means of transport if you travel in Switzerland. Car train ride from the town called Kandestad to Kopenstein and into Tash. So, where、uh, we board a train to Zermatt. So, Zermatt is a car forbidden town where you can't see any car there and you need to take a train up to Zermatt. So, you board the train from Tash. So we arrive in Zermatt in the evening. So it is quite late already, but it is equally a stunning city. So we took a walk around the city first, then we decided to walk up to a nearby hill to see the Matterhorn at its night time. Actually, I'd like to tell you something. To walk up the hill in order to see the night time of the Matterhorn and、uh, with its、uh, city Zermatt, it is actually not easy. There was a、um, deep climb up, so we took around more than half an hour to climb up the mountain and try to see the night time of the <coughs> night light、um, and the night time of the Matterhorn. Matterhorn <coughs> is beautiful. Um, As you can see, we are not young already, so to climb the mountain it is a, a great achievement. Well, at least to us. <laughs> Later on, we had our late dinner in a nearby restaurant. Food was not that good because it was too late at night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I really love our hotel room. I'll show you here. It is in the central of the Zermatt city, so it's got a stunning view from our、uh, veranda there. Next morning, we woke up really early、uh, to view Matterhorn from Zermatt city. It was so beautiful. 
so I use my camera to time lace this beautiful mountain. So on the final day, we bought a train up to, um, to the mountains, uh, up to the Konograd, the final station, um, so the highest point of the uh, Zama city, where we can see glaciers and uh, the panoramic view of the area, so where we also can get a closer look at the Matterhorn. Zama city and Konograd in the terrain right is um, called Riverson. So in Riverson, um, there is more magnificent views of the mountains ranges and we can also get a uh, closer look at Matterhorn as well as the lake where we can see the reflection of Matterhorn. So shoot more, we can shoot more photos there and more beautiful photos from there. Amazing. Next, we arrive in Gonograd, the highest point for the tourists to reach.
le pont remonte donc depuis là à revenir ici et 10 20 minutes. Finally, we are back to Zermatt city again, um, so we are going to see more of the Zermatt before heading our trip to Interlaken. We can see the old part of Zermatt city. It is so amazing to see how they um, they construct their house in the olden time. It's amazing to see all the um, all the small house. They are so small. I just wonder how can they fit into this all this small house with the tall people like people in um, the uh, the Switzerland. Finally, thank you so much for your watching. And I'll see you next in my next episode of a more interesting town in Switzerland. <laughs>